I'm not sure either, Kerry. By the way, did you see that national championship trophy that Coach Stallings and Coach Erickson were standing by? That national championship trophy was made by Tiffany's. And believe me, they need an army of people to carry that crystal ball around because you cannot even come close to even thinking about breaking that. Now, that'll do it for 4 News Now at 6. Don't miss the King Orange Jamboree. It's next on Channel 4. We'll see you at 8 o'clock for our big sports special. It's something you're not going to want to miss. And then back here for a special New Year's Eve edition of the Nightcast. Good night, everybody. The King Orange Jamboree Parade is brought to you in part by Ed Helms Electric. Jamboree Parade. Our host for tonight, Faith Daniels, Joe Namath, and Kelly Craig. You'll enjoy Florida's finest marching band, most dazzling floats, meet the 1992 Orange Bowl Queen and her court, and much, much more. And now your host for this New Year's Eve spectacular, Faith Daniels, Joe Namath, and Kelly Craig. Good evening, everyone. I'd like to begin by welcoming you both to Miami. We're all so excited to be joined for this big New Year's Eve celebration. It's great to be here and great to be a part of this tradition down here. You can feel the excitement in the air. Oh, you know, the first time I was here was in 1962, and I am aware of this tradition. It's been wonderful for me. And folks, for the past 59 years, there have been spectacular floats, singing, dancing, and marching along this beautiful Biscayne Boulevard. And this year's parade promises to be more exciting than ever. And to kick things off, we've got the City of Miami Motors roaring onto the parade route. Let's take a look. And following right along is the city of Miami's most prestigious police unit, the Greater Miami Police Honor Guard. Its 25 members represent the various divisions within the police department and are selected for appearance, punctuality, dress, and superior service. Well, that looks like some tough duty to me, man. You know, those guys are dedicated. Punctuality you know, would be my toughest. <laughs> I'm, no one's going to argue with you. You know, the officers are carrying flags and swords as they march down the boulevard. Four members of the City Miami Bicycle Corps, along with 14 members of Miami's Mounted Patrol, accompany the Honor Guard. Falling in behind the city's finest police officers are some of our finest musicians, the Dade County Public Schools Orange Bowl Honors Band. Students from all over the county are chosen by audition to form this 350-person all-state band. And they are under the direction of Dade County Supervisor of Music, Marilyn Von Sagren. This band represents 21 different schools. You know, it's certainly not evident by the way they look tonight, but they've only been together for about three rehearsals. I guess that's why they're the cream of the crop. crowd really enthusiastic tonight. We're hoping to stave off some rain. However, some sprinkles might come through, but uh, keeping our fingers crossed. Bite your tongue. It's never rained on a King Orange Parade, Kelly. Well, I wouldn't go that far, but uh, we're hoping it stays away tonight. Well, it comes and goes. You know, that's part of the territory. There's it's... some high stepping for you, huh? Yeah, boy, my knees are working that way these days, too. <laughs>